Uh, good morning and happy Sabbath. Uh, how are you doing today? All right, let us pray for the country nugget. Dear Lord, such as and holy Father, thank you for your grace and mercy, O Lord. Lord, thank you for carrying us today to worship with you. As we're about to read about the country living, I'm asking to convict us, O Lord. Help us to be willing to go to the country. Jesus' precious name I pray. Amen. Character development easier in the country. Parents flock with their families to the cities because they fancy it easier to obtain a livelihood here than in the country. The children having nothing to do when not in school obtain a street education. From Eve Associates, they acquire habits of vice and dissip dissipation. Well, I, I believe this is true. When, in the, when I'm not in school, I like now, there, there is more influence to me at home because I have free time, more free time, and uh, I lose focus, all those things. Send the children to schools located in the city where every face of temptation is waiting to attract and demoralize them and the work of character building is tenfold harder than tenfold harder for both parents and children. And I think our parents can testify to this. When in the especially mine when I'm in the city, she have more problem with me. The cities are filled with temptation. We should plan our work in such a way as to keep our young people as far as possible from this contamination. It is time for our people to take their families from the cities into more retired localities, as many of the youth and many also of the older in years will be ensnared and taken by the enemy. There is not one family in a hundred who will be improved physically, mentally, or spiritually by residing in the city. Faith, hope, love, happiness can far better be gained in retired places where there are fields and hills and trees. Take your children away from the sights and sounds of the city, away from the rattle and din of the street cars and teams and their minds will become more healthy. It will be found easier to bring home to their hearts the truth of the word of God. Let us pray. <coughs> Dear Most Righteous and Heavenly Father, thank you for giving us this reading and your profit, O oh Lord. Lord, I'm asking to help us to be here ready for our country living, O oh Lord. Help us to have a change of character while in the city so that it will be easier to go to the country, O oh Lord. Lord, I'm asking to keep away all distractions while we are in the city. Bless the proceedings today. Forgive us for our many sins, known and unknown. Jesus' precious name I pray. Amen. And I'm a stranger. I can tarry, I can tarry, but I know. Do not detain me, for I am going to where the fountains are ever flowing. I'm a pilgrim, and I'm a stranger.